Hey, this is the InDesign Helper, and today I'm going to show you the Pencil Tool. If you haven't seen my video on using the Pen Tool, I'm going to put it right up here in this card. But really, it's the same exact thing. The difference is, it's more freeformed. A lot of people use freeform if they're using a tablet, or they just like to have a more natural look to it. So, if we go over here to the corner, it would be right under the pen tool and you could use N on your keyboard if you want to use the shortcut. As you can see, we also have two other tools with it, the smooth tool and the erase tool. I'll briefly go over them right now, but I will make a separate video for them. So for the pen tool is like the pen tool and the pencil tool basically are synonymous with each other. One is just more freeform. So for example, let's increase this. This is the stroke or the line thickness. Now we go in and make our line, we let go, and boom. Now we have our pencil. Now what we could do is we could decrease, increase, we could change the style of this line, we could change the color of this line, we could change the fill if we want to. And this is what we get. Of course, this is a line, it's not a closed shape. That's why it looks like that. And we could do a ton of different things like opacity, adding a drop shadow, even maybe changing the edges a bit. But this is not that good when it comes to lines. It's moreover once you're using a closed fixed shape like a rectangle, a square, uh, something like that. And that is how you use the pencil tool. You could also have different reference points here when you're rotating it. You could increase, decrease the size here. You could rotate it here and you could even move it across the document using the X and Y axis here. Everything here is at your disposal when you're using the pencil tool. I usually don't use the pencil tool, but if this is something that you like, you like using freeformed or you have a tablet and you want to be more customized and how do I say more analog in a digital world, this is a tool for you. Check out these other videos right here to see how to use the other tools so you could be the best 